Stay sharp. We're going in. Oh, hey, it's him. Glad to see you made it. I heard you managed to escape, but I didn't expect to see old Iron Mask with you. In any case, we're all wanted by the Renans. It'll be easier for everyone if you both just come with me. Where are the others? They're waiting for us up ahead. Come on. was embedded within her all along. No matter. Kill her if you have to. Just retrieve the core. Attack! So what's gonna happen is half of his mask gonna fall off or something? Give me a second, people. You okay? Your arms! Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. How about that? Guess it's just as well I can't feel it, huh? You're not in agony? Wait, are you serious? Hold still. Huh? It's one of my healing arts. A sword that sears the hand of he who wields it, and a healing art to mend. A man numb to pain, and a woman whose very touch deals nothing but. Thank you. <sighs> All right. Let's rout the bastards and finish them off before the surviving stragglers have a chance to regroup. Iron Mask, you coming? Definitely. I'm not about to go back all that way alone. So I guess you're not planning on releasing me, huh? Sorry. You're coming with us. In that case, there's one thing you should know. No one uses that flaming sword without my say-so. You needn't worry on that score. I doubt many of us could get close to it in the first place, or would want to. The Blazing Sword. It just might be strong enough to match the power of a lord. No, maybe even to surpass it. Are you sure you're okay? Uh, what do you mean? 
Your wound. That soldier nailed you pretty good. Not to mention those flames bursting from you. They only hit my master core, so I'll be fine. And the flames weren't even hot. It's probably because they're just a manifestation of the astral energy. Honestly, I'm more surprised that you really are incapable of feeling pain. Did you think I was faking? No, I believed you. I guess seeing you stay calm while bearing those burns to your hands just really made it hit home for me. It's ironic. I have no problem hurting anyone who touches me. But as soon as I try to wield that sword, it's me who gets hurt. Do you wish you were impervious to pain too? You realize you could burn your fingers off without even noticing, right? So what? All I need right now is power. And up until now, I haven't come across anything stronger than that blazing sword the whole time I've been doing this. You really don't care what happens to you as long go. as you get what you're after, do you? Don't talk like you know me. Uh. <sighs> you... <sighs> you're right. I don't get you. I don't get why you're so quick to throw it all away. Not when us slaves have never had a choice in whether we lived or died. CP to use and run your CP total. The auto mode is enabled, she will primarily target flying and extra hard wielding enemies. As well as full and more HP than combat. Cure points. Arts with healing and support effects consume cure points. In addition to AG, CP is shared across the party and can be restored with items or by staying in an inn or campground. It can be raised by leveling up or finding specific items. Got a little Midori dash. All right. Can you even see out of that thing? Like, at all? Of course I can. How else do you think I manage to avoid tripping everywhere I go? What is that thing anyway? It doesn't look like anything Dan and I've ever seen. Beats me. I don't remember anything about my past. When I came to, I was already wearing it. If I could get it off, I would. Damn thing makes it hard to eat. And I can't scratch my face when it itches. It's the worst. Honestly, I'm just impressed you've managed to survive this long looking like that. I'm sure you attract attention wherever you go. Most of the other Danans don't pay it any mind. It's in everyone's best interest to just keep their heads down, focus on their work, and pretend they don't notice. What about the Renan soldiers? Didn't they notice? The guards? 
They're more the kill first, ask questions later type. Be in the wrong place or step out of line and you're dead. Mask or no mask. That said, as long as you keep your head down and don't cause trouble, they mostly ignore you. Honestly, sometimes they don't look all that keen to stir up trouble themselves. A friend of mine said it's because if they kill us without a good reason, it could delay the work and put them behind schedule. At that point, it'd be their necks on the line. You should know more about all that than me, though, right? I don't serve any of the Lords. But I see what you mean. After three centuries of run and rule without much upheaval, it's possible the soldiers might be losing their edge. All this trouble we've caused might be the first excitement they've had in a while. Well, I don't plan on getting killed for their amusement. Stone and swirling ash, what was called here? Called me. Go to hell. That's Glanamede Castle, stronghold of Lord Balseth, self imposed ruler of all Calaglia. I've never seen it from this close before. That's it, all right. And next to it are the gates of fire. Take a good long look while you still can. That wall is what we've come to tear down. The only thing standing between us and freedom. Freedom. Let's go. Close to a Zugal, they'll attack.
controls during combat. During combat, press square, press options, allowing the menu to change your character's control mode. Semi-auto automatically moves until attack range. Manual flip control. Auto fights based on strategy. Semi-auto is designed for players that only wish to casually dabble in combat. Meanwhile, manual mode is for those who can play the game. While auto lets the game take place. You're surrounded. Mirage, stay calm. Take it. Rising wyvern. Mirage. Don't let them form a pack. Here I come. Take it. Slack. You're not giving up now, are you? No. I repeat. Did you just heal me? Yes. I need you, remember? Right. Swallow blade. It's not going to plan. How's this? See ya. Take it. It's over! Cannon! Stop! Get you through! See ya! Tower storm! Everything's coming up, Zephyr! Don't fight any enemies you can otherwise avoid, all right? Makes sense. If we try to... Don't get careless! Don't tell me! You're mine! I'm on it! it no! Can't end here! Fall back! Tusk cannon! Circle I'll and bring, bring them down! down. I'll run you through! Resuscitation! Not oh, done yet! You're mine! See ya! Talon storm! Tusk cannon! Take it! You're Come. mine! I'll run you through. I can feel my power growing. I was gonna say that was a mistake. sense a strange power from it. We should gather as many as we can find. This is... Seems you found something good. Supplies like that are valuable. Never overlook them. Got it. I'll remember that. Ah, here we go. Now this. Let's stop a moment to catch our breath. But I barely worked up a sweat. Speak for yourself. What do you want, a medal? Doesn't look like we're being followed. Fail to grab these rare moments of quiet when you can. You'll end up regretting it later. You're the boss. Camping out. Resting at campgrounds will restore your party's HP and CP. Normally, we should take turns standing guard. But this first time, I'll watch over things so you two can... Zephyr, why aren't you concerned about who I am? You feeling left out, son? No, it's not that, but... You said you wanted to fight so that you can live a free man. At this point, 
That's all that matters. Even if it somehow turned out you were a Renan, it wouldn't be such a big deal. A Renan? Until we know who you are, we can't rule anything out. Besides, we've already got Xion with us. At this point, what's one more Renan as long as they're on our side? So you don't see every Renan as an enemy? Our goal isn't to hunt down and kill all Renans. We only arm ourselves as much as we need to, to set ourselves free. If you can believe it, not every Danon agrees with what we're doing either. Are you saying we have enemies among the Danons? Uh, not quite. They're just not up for rebelling, per se. The thing you have to remember is that everyone has their own path to walk. I'm not sure I understand. That's okay. Just focus on what we have to do right now. However, the time will come when you'll need to decide what to do for yourself. How come you don't have a scar on your hand? A scar? What do you mean? The Crimson Crows all tore off their own spirit course, right? But your hand doesn't show any signs of ever having a core like theirs. Why not? I don't know. I don't remember anything about myself from before Doc found me. Seriously? You have that mask, you don't feel any pain, and you just happen to know how to fight with a sword? No way. You must remember something. I'm not lying if that's what you think. Believe me, I wish I knew who the hell I am. But I don't. It's funny how I didn't have any time for soul-searching while digging up rocks in a mine. Still. Are you saying you've told us everything about yourself? Zephyr? It's bad manners to pry when you've got plenty to hide yourself. Hmm. <laughs> huh. You're not gonna ask me about my past, too? Only when I think it's necessary. You're a real man of mystery, I'll admit. That said, I'm not one to dig around in someone's business just out of curiosity. If you remember something and feel like sharing, you're free to do so. For now, I think that's good enough. Right. Thank you. <sighs> Alright. I already got more. So, this whole you not feeling pain thing, is that for real? Why would I lie about it? It's important. Why would you me. care anyway? Oh, it's no, it's just, you know, I can't imagine <laughs> what it's like. It's that's all. As a slave, I'd say it has its advantages and disadvantages. Oh? On the upside, when Ren and soldiers push me around, I hardly flinch. The downside's that I get injured without even noticing. Which means I could be knocking on death's door and not even realize it. Really? Sure. I may be numb to pain, but that doesn't make me immortal or anything. Still, I wouldn't have noticed any of this if someone hadn't pointed it out to me. If not for my fellow slaves, I'd be long dead, lying in a ditch somewhere. Clean a little okay, finally we got done. Early game booster packs. I'm not buying a booster pack for a game like this. Let's get our rest so we can continue with this story. A Master Corps, huh? Now I see. So that's why Balsef's cronies were so desperate to catch her. Is that what it's called? The jewel in her chest? Oh, right. You don't remember a damn thing, do you? Ah, fair enough. I guess it's time to fill you back in. Tell me. You ever wonder why we Danans are made to work ourselves to the bone, day in, day out? Well, when you put it like that, I always just assumed we were mining resources for them. And don't you think it'd be quicker if they used all that high-powered tech they have? Why go to all the trouble of relying on weak human labor? Listen, what the Renans are really after isn't resources or minerals. It's astral energy. They're harvesting the astral energy that sleeps inside all matter in life forms. 
And they're doing it the same way they have for the past 300 years. Using us Danans as mere siphons. Ah. Right. They have machines for minerals, but extracting from Danans requires spirit cores. Any astral energy collected passes through a spirit vessel on its way to being stored in a master core. But why go to the trouble of collecting all this energy in the first place? Do they really need all that juice just to use astral arts? It determines the Sovereign. Sovereign? Is that the Renan ruler? Exactly. Five lords, each doing whatever it takes to gather as much astral energy as they can and store it in their master cores. Whichever of them manages to accumulate the most power at the end of their contest is crowned the ruler of the Renan Motherland. A new crown contest, as they call it, is held every decade or so. So you see, the Master Cores are the receptacles in which the Lords store their power. And we Danans are sacrificed, so the Renans can choose their new ruler. That's insane! You're telling me that's what our people have been dying for this whole time?! Relax, hero. You're not the only one who's bent out of shape about the whole thing. There are two things that I haven't been able to get my head around yet. What business would a Renan have stealing a Master Core? And what's the deal with that blazing sword? I think the sword is a physical manifestation of the Master Core's astral energy. As for why it took the shape of a sword, well, I don't know any more than you do. Honest. And that stuff about needing your permission to use it? What was that about? I'm the only one of us who can control the Master Core to some extent. Without me to adjust the flow of astral energy, the sword can't take a physical form. What do you want out of this? You may be one of them, but you don't strike me as the ruthless oppressor type. I'm going to take down all of the Lords. That's what she says. Never thought I'd say this, but I like the cut of your jib, Renan. <laughs> Very well. As far as we're concerned, the struggle continues either way. And with that sword on our side, our chances of victory just increased. That is, of course, assuming we can count the two of you in. Fine by me. After all, it sounds like we're after the same thing anyway. I... <laughs> Honestly, I'm still a little confused by all this. But if it's a choice between this or going back to being a slave, then I choose to fight. Then it's settled. Together we'll overthrow the Renan Lords. And first up on that chopping block is Balsef, the wild beast. Sound good? Saw tentacles. I'm just gonna assume that that wasn't what I thought it meant. I've gotta hurry. <laughs> we have another secret hideout in Ulzebek, not far from here. We should be able to meet up with our cop. Cut it out. Didn't anyone ever tell you it's rude to stare? I know I already asked you this, but are you sure we haven't met somewhere before? <sighs> What's so hard to understand? I'm Renan, you're Danon. There's no way. Besides, I'm from Lenegas. Trust me, wherever you were before you lost your memory, we've never crossed paths. Lenegas? You mean the same Lenegas that's up in the sky? I've heard it called the Renan's Castle, but I never imagined people actually lived up there. Well then, where did you think we all lived? Didn't you see the Renan Lords descend for the crown contest? And how long ago was that? 
Well, the current contest started seven years ago, so... Then I wouldn't remember. Just how far back do you remember? About a year, give or take. That's how long ago Doc found me. One year. Then no. I'm sorry, but there really is no way we could have met. Guess not. Oh, that's that one. So, time to take off. You should be able to eat this. Whenever you find some, make sure to grab it. Oh, it's wheat. Oh, it's edible, it? huh? Good to know. Definitely. Mm. Money. What's, What's this deal? thing? Look. That is one enormous stray. I don't think we can take it right now. We've almost made it to Ulzebeck. Normally, I don't pick on this. Here I come. This is it. Dig deep. Easier said than done. No excuses. This is up to us. Guess we gotta roll with it. This is not going to plan. I owe you one. You're surrounded. Just stay calm. You're on. It's over. Take it. I'm on it. I'm sure I can put this to use. What's this thing? Take a look at that. 